Chris 6 News at Noon continues. Well, good noon time, everybody. 65 degrees right about now. Just a few clouds lingering, but uh, I'm, I'm very confident that we're going to see some sun this afternoon. The winds are out of the north. They came in with that front that came through about 1 o'clock this morning. We got a little bit of rain, probably less than a tenth of an inch in most areas. Not much, but now we've got pressure building, and that's going to squeeze out all that moisture out of the air. Look at the north winds blowing basically 15 to 20 miles an hour, so that's keeping us on the cool side of things. We did get up to 79 yesterday. Today we're barely in the mid-60s, 63 in Port Aransas and Kingsville as well. But look at that. Somebody's getting a little sunshine. As a matter of fact, if you drive up the road in San Antonio and even in uh, uh, Three Rivers and George West, it's clear and blue up there. So it's going to be real nice. The cloud deck's burning off. And for the next few days, you're going to really enjoy being outdoors because of the sunshine. There you see our visible satellite picture from 930 this morning. You can see how the deck of clouds thinning out pretty rapidly and it's all moving out to sea. So just a few lingering clouds and that's about it. As high pressure builds in, we're going to squeeze out a lot of this moisture and the, the humidity is really going to drop tonight. That's going to make it rather chilly in the morning, but the uh, daytimes will be very pleasant. Here's that rain band that came through about one o'clock this morning. Oh, by sunrise, it was all gone. So no more rain in sight for the next four or five days. In fact, that's the most important part of this whole forecast is for those of you that need dry weather, we've got about six days of dry weather in store. So here's our front. Here's the high pressure that's coming in. That's going to build in and keep us on the quiet side. Clear, cool nights and sunny, mild days over the next couple of days. Eventually, we'll have to deal with this frontal system, but this one is actually not going straight to us. It's going to be dropping down on California and then turning up. But it looks like by the time it gets here, our atmosphere will be so dry that it won't have anything to work with. So we're going to basically call it a dry front as far as we're concerned. Still pretty cold along the Canadian border, minus two at Minot, but for us, we're in the mild 60s, and we're going to stay in the mid 60s, warming up a little bit by the time we get to the weekend. So north winds today, that keeps us dry. Tomorrow, lots of sunshine, and for your Valentines, yes, still on the sunny side. Funny thing is that by the time we get to Friday and Saturday, we're going to pick up a very strong south-southwest wind. Well, that's actually going to dry us up and make it very arid, so lots of sun. And when this front gets here, we won't have anything to work with, so we're going to call it clear and cool for the early part of the weekend, temperatures in the mid-60s. So drying up, and finally, an extended period of dry weather here in South Texas.